luces, cámara, acción. Y hoy nos encontramos en el Garden Theater, aquí en Winter Garden, donde vamos a darle una probadita de lo que será Destiny of Desire, la primera obra en Spanglish que se va a dar aquí en el teatro de Garden Theater. Así que acompáñame a ver cómo está la cosa, cómo van las entrevistas eh, y por qué Winter Garden decide hacer esta obra aquí. Así que, let's go. And my blood turns to stone. She's forever gone. Y nos encontramos aquí en el Garden Theater, en Winter Garden, y me encuentro con la directora de la obra, que es Slash Obra, Slash Comedia, Slash Stand Up. So, tenemos ahí unas cositas y se llama Destiny of Desire. Es una obra que es en Spanglish, la primera obra hispana que se presenta aquí en el Garden Theater. Melissa. Hola. 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 <risa> es Melissa Crespo. Melissa, ¿cómo te encuentras? Ay, muy orgullosa. So, so proud and happy to be here with this fantastic, very funny play in the best theater in the southeastern United States. <risa> so, tengo entendido que es la, es la cuarta eh, producción que se hace, mm -hmm. pero es la primera que se hace en el sureste de los Estados Unidos. Sí, es la primera producción en Florida, en la southeastern part of the U.S., and I am indeed the first female director and this only the second director to direct the play. Bravo por eso. Ella dice que es la segunda directora en dirigir esta pieza y es mujer, así que bravo por nosotras. Entonces, te hago una pregunta. ¿De qué trata Destiny of Desire? So the play is a telenovela inspired comedy. So the playwright Karen Zacharias, she takes the genre of telenovelas and puts it into a two hour play. And so it's very much celebrating the genre of telenovelas. And there's two girls that are born on the same day in the same hospital and they're switched at birth. And then can, I, you can only imagine one's poor, one's rich, very classic telenovela, fair, and there's just tons of wacky, situations, love triangles, mistaken identities. My sister, please find me. I'm lost in the storm. Well, his name is Rob Anderson. Rob, how are you today? I'm great, thank you. Well, thank you for being here with us. Um, this is gonna be very quick, very easy. The question is, what make you choose a Spanish play for here for the Garden Theater? In searching for the shows that we wanted to do this season, um, looking for works that were very diverse was important to me. And I was searching around and I saw in Washington DC they were having the Women's Voices Theater Festival. Okay. Uh, a female playwright was someone that I was looking for because I feel like more women should be represented on the stage in many ways. Thank you very much you're for that. You're welcome. <laughs> um, and so I saw that this was a telenovela inspired play and that just really intrigued me. I thought, what are they gonna, how, how's that being done? And it was getting really great reviews in Washington DC. So I contacted the playwright, Karen Zacharias, and um, asked her if I could read the script and she said yes and sent it to me and I loved it. We all loved it, it was so funny. <laughs> and um, at that point, Um, we went through her agent and she said, yes, you can have the rights to it. And we've just been going after that, working very hard to bring this production to the stage.